Atlanta United is stacked with attacking talent, with the likes of league MVP Joseph Martinez and soon-to-be Premier League star Miguel Almiron amongst them. But the crucial opening goal of Atlanta United's MLS Cup final win over the Portland Timbers was created by its two center backs. This is the anatomy of a goal. While the crucial moment that creates the goal centers around Michael Parker's tackle, and we'll get to that in a second, let's first look at how his defensive partner, Leandro Gonzalez Perez, affects the play. Up to this point in the match, Atlanta had played relatively conservatively, as is to be expected in a cup final. In the 39th minute, Gonzalez Perez finally broke that mold, going on an attacking run up the left side. Even after Atlanta was dispossessed, he continued to press the Timbers deep in their own territory, forcing a long clearance to striker Jeremy Abobasi in a central area. And this is when Atlanta's preparation and Michael Parker's soccer IQ kick in. Parker's revealed after the match that goalkeeper Brad Gazan had told him that when Abobasi wants to check for the ball, he'll drift to his right. As you can see in the film, Parker's follows Ebabise, knowing he's going to his right, and is able to dispossess the striker before he can release the ball to a teammate. Whether it was a bit of good luck or skillfully done, Parker's tackle goes right to Joseph Martinez, who was held in an onside position by Portland Timbers center back Larry's Mabiala. Why was Mabiala holding Martinez onside? He was back defending Leandro Gonzalez Perez, who had gone on his forward run. All of these actions created this singular moment for Joseph Martinez to be able to collect the ball in a fair position, round goalkeeper Jeff Atanella, and score Atlanta's goal that would lead them to an MLS Cup championship. <laughs> 